Welcome back for another episode of Vlogmas 2022 Living Room Tour Edition. And we're back on the channel with yet another episode of Vlogmas. So thank you all for of Vlogmas. Thank you all for joining me here once again for yet another video. We are over here in the family room area and we're going to decorate the fireplace as well as put up a tree over here in this area. And again, like I said, I have collected so many trees over the past few years and uh, even while getting rid of trees and still collecting trees go figure well i've also given away some trees or let uh lent out some trees as well so stay tuned in again for all of the festivities and all of the videos that is to come or vlogs i'm not used to doing this so yeah <laughs> however you want to call it but stay tuned in for all of the festivities on all of the videos and i hope you are getting inspired motivated to get moving creating something beautiful as i always say if not for yourself and definitely for definitely someone. for someone else so let's get right into the video i'm going to add a tree over here this tree is going to be just a basic green tree i do still have the tree in my sitting area which is upstairs i still have a tree up there as well because that again was a that was a review product from Vingley and I did leave that information in the description box as well as for the tree that is in the entryway of the formal living room. So with this tree it's just going to be a green tree so we're going with more with greens, browns, cognacs in this space once again because I still have those colors here from the fall and so why not just continue on with them because again I don't like to switch things out a whole lot just a few simple items and in this case it's just adding a few simple items to the well I figured out here that the sound did not go just to the cloud <laughs> what happened was is my mic went off and I don't know what happened but this is one of the reasons why I didn't want to use a mic because when you're recording, you're not quite sure, then you have to go back and record again if you notice it. Me, I did not notice it, but until after, and I had did all my decorating, but anyway. What I'm explaining here is about the garland, and I purchased this garland on last year, um, you know, at the end of the season, which is a great time to go out and purchase the day after Christmas, and you get lots and lots of deals on the sale. And I purchased this last year and this is a, the faux garland that a lot of people are using now and I really like the look of it. It looks very, very real. It actually feels real and oddly enough, it actually smells real. I don't know if it just came from the scents that I had in the house on last year when I packed it away that the scent just carried and stayed with it while I had it packed away until I brought it out for this year's season of the Vlogmas. And uh, what I'm going to do is just place all of the garden right along the fireplace in front of the uh, mirror here. But for now, I'm putting it out of the way as I get ready and prepare the rest of the area for the garland. What I'm going to do is put the tree together first and then I will proceed to add the garland to the top of the mantle. I forgot to mention while I was doing all of this uh, with the garland. The garland is, I have four different pieces. Two of them are like eight feet long and the other two are like six feet long. And again, I purchased them off season from Home Goods on last year. So let's get right into putting up the tree. As usual, you know, with these trees, they come with a stand and I have to prepare the stand and get ready to place it on the floor for the tree and then find my exact placement of exactly where I want it to go. Start with the bottom layer as usual for those of you who've never put up a tree and I know there are some people out here who don't put up trees and this could be your first year. So of course you'll place the bottom layer on. Usually they are labeled when they do come out of the box, you know, one, two or three or A, B, C, D, I usually like to give an overview of what the room is looking like 
uh, pre all decor added especially the pillows and different accessories that may be added to the space so here is the pillows that i'm going to use the creams and browns and the emerald city green that is on my etsy shop which will be linked down below i'll go ahead and add all of the pillows to the sofa and i may switch out a couple of them for a printed pillow we'll see as it goes throughout the video once I'm done with that I will proceed right over to the top of the fireplace mantle I'm gonna keep it pretty much simple I have these brown reindeer that I've had for a few years now probably about four years and uh, they are mighty and robust in their size with this stately look that they have gorgeous in the brown and i'm just going to add both of those to the top of the tree and then the console table i moved to the back of the sofa i told you there is a lot of room behind the sofa they think my fireplace is covered but it's actually not covered it's just not open in front of the sectional as you can see here in the video but it's very open to the back of the sofa with plenty of room This item I have went out thrifting a couple of weeks ago and I showed this on a previous video but I was showing it again because I was using the second one which I made as you can see in the photo here that I did purchase two of these beautiful emerald green bowls and within the bowl I had an idea what I already wanted to do with them which was make candles inside of it so I got out my trusty candle making kit and supplies and created a candle for some beautiful ambiance in this beautiful green bowl and here it sits on the coffee table for the Christmas holiday season which was definitely what I had it in mind for and now we've come to the end of the video and I will give you a tour around the entire room and show you the fireplace area as well as the seating area around the sectional the living area and as always stay inspired motivated and moving creating something beautiful for yourself if not for someone else this has been chanel continue to stay tuned in for all the videos for vlogmas and i'll see you all in the next one on tomorrow bye for now